Hi, I'm Lauren Lanning, co-founder and creator of Oddworld, and I'm excited to be here at Future Games Show to bring you this abridged playthrough from Oddworld Soulstorm. At this point in the game, we're on a mission to hijack a train that we're told is at Fat Station. And so with each level, you get an introduction, usually of your goal happening in the background. And now we settle down to where Abe just entered into the scene. And now he needs to get to the fat station to hijack a train. And that should be up ahead. And now he's got a little bit of a journey through the world to get there. Okay, so now you're approaching, you see a train in the distance pulling in. And now you're approaching the fat station. So now you knew you had to reach the fast station, and there's a train, and you know you gotta hijack a train, but you're gonna have to get through the fat station first. And this is a lot of where we wanted more of the story telling us through the 2.9D camera. So we have that setup and that approach. It feels more cinematic. And here you can get an overlook. And if we look in there, this is the tanks and the whole area we're gonna have to get through. And now you're dealing with snipers. You're running across steam vents. And I'm gonna go down here. We wanted to get more of that sense of height and perspective and all that. And it also reveals secret areas that you wouldn't normally see where you can go collect goods and stuff. But we're not gonna go there right now because we're just gonna continue on and start going into the tank field because we still gotta get to the pump so we can get to the train so we can complete our mission and then catch up with our buddies at the trellis area. Here's some classic Abe play where, you know, he's using steam zones to hide from the enemies and they can't see, they're kind of blind in the steam zone. So using the old odd world logic, if you can't see Abe barely, then neither can the enemies. And this was a way that you could have traversed to get past this slick. But if you use your, if you crafted up some inventory to this point, this would have been a stealth approach with no killing happening. This would be a little more uh, not nice approach where you might have used something a little more lethal. And that would be very nice. You don't want to do that, of course. Oops. Uh, but it's a different way to solve the same problem. And along the way, we're hearing radio broadcasts that are telling us, filling us more in on the backstory, the propaganda of the world, what they're telling the common people versus what you know is actually happening in the game. So we play off of that during these elevator rides. And if you pay attention to them, you get a little more data on the backstory and what's happening in the world. We're getting now to the pump area. There's all these more physical challenges where there's Mudokans you're gonna have to get in through the pump all the way up to the train way above. So now this is like a tower of hazards and you're gonna get more and more Mudokans to go through here with you. And you're gonna try not to get them killed or yourself. cabled the world, and when these cables are pulled and activated, you'll see the pulses running. So it really helped with people understanding what the problem, the, the puzzles were here in cases like this. So you're getting more and more Mudokins following you through more and more dangerous conditions. <laughs> and they're stacking up more and more, and the more you get, the easier it is to get lots of them more killed, even though you shouldn't. Come on, go, 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 go. Okay. <laughs> and killing them, of course, is not the best karma. Here to break you up. Oh. 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 And now, well, you only got there with, what, two? One? <laughs> One survivor. He gets rescued. And from here, and look at all my dead guys, but from here, this gets us up to the area of the train station where we can now access the train that will then lead us on our mission forward. And 
Oddworld Soulstorm is coming to the PS5, PS4, and the Epic Game Store April 6th. You can pre-purchase the game now on the Epic Game Store, and PlayStation 5, PS Plus members will be able to download the game at no extra cost.